Folks looking to buy a home may finally be getting a break this year, or maybe it's just a blip of new data. But since peaking up over 18% back in the 1980s, U.S. mortgage rates, 30-year rates, have been falling pretty steadily for about 40 years now until last year when they started rising up to almost 6%. But we had some good news the last couple weeks as they started falling again and now back down just below 5%, which coincides with the Fed raising interest rates earlier this year. Uh, will rates continue to fall? Who knows? Most realtors, though, say if you're looking to buy a house, don't wait for conditions to be perfect. Consider locking in a rate now so that you're safe if rates rise. Date the rate, marry the house. Purchase your home and you know you're gonna have the opportunity, whether it's in six months or a year or a year and a half, to what, to refinance and lower your interest rate back down. Experts also say if you're looking for a home loan, shop around, try to find the best rate. On Wall Street, the Dow continued its hot streak today, gaining 151 points, closed at 33,912. The index is up almost 3,000 points over the last month, though it's still down about 3,000 from its all-time high set last fall. And gas prices are inching back down. The national average for a gallon of regular fell another 10 cents over the last week to 3.95. North Dakota's average fell six cents to 391. Minnesota's fell 10 cents to 387. The prices do vary quite a bit from county to county.